In this video, we'll show you how to create a new search from scratch and save it as a selection. Your new search starts by clicking the Find button in the top menu. The Find feature allows you to search for any information saved in your database. You can create a list containing the data you are looking for by using specific search criteria. By saving search results as a selection, you're able to perform various actions, such as update information in your CRM solution, send a marketing mailing, or create follow-up activities. To start a new search and create a selection, click on the Find button in the top menu. This is the Find screen. You can create a new search by clicking on any of the categories that you want to focus on. Or you can use one of our many typical predefined searches. Each category has its own set of typical searches. You can use these searches as they are or change the search criteria to create the search you need. In this video, we'll show you how you can create a search from scratch. As an example, let's find all customers that I had a meeting with last month. Since we're looking for customers, we'll start by selecting the company category. In the Find Company screen, you can add the search criteria you need to find your specific data. You'll see that SuperOffice offers you a default filter. You can use this filter, change it, or delete it. Because we are looking for all customers whom we had a meeting with, we'll use this default filter as is. To add a new filter, click the Add button. In the drop-down menu that appears, choose Follow-up. This will open the drop-down list of all the fields available for an activity or an appointment. Scroll down to find the field called Type. In the second field, choose Is One Of because you want the follow-ups to match the value you are about to add. Finally, you want to add the activity types you want to find. Click on the third field and choose Meeting, Internal, and Meeting, External from the drop-down menu. We have now added the criteria to search for these specific types of appointments. Next, we need to add the filter to specify the time period that we are interested in. Click the Add button. In the drop-down menu, choose Follow-up. This time, we'll select Date from the drop-down menu. In the second field, choose Previous from the drop-down menu. You'll see that the third field now changes and allows you to add the number of days and months. Click where it says Days and choose Months. This way, you will find all the meetings from last month. The search is now ready. Press Find in the bottom right corner to see your results. The results screen shows all the customers I had booked a meeting with last month. When you click on any of the meetings that you found, the preview screen in the side panel will give you additional information about this customer. If this is a list you want to reuse later, you can save this search as either a dynamic or a static selection. A dynamic selection is always up to date. Any entry in your database that matches your search criteria is automatically added to your selection. A static selection will only change if you manually add or remove items from this list. Let's save our search as a dynamic selection. In the selection screen, you can see all the information you saved in your selection. Also, you still have access to the criteria screen. At any time, you can go back and change your search criteria to improve your search. You can use the selection to perform a range of tasks. For example, you can send a mailing and create activities manage the information in your selection, print or export your data, or delete the information in your selection from your database. We have now shown you how to create a search from scratch and save it as a selection. We've also looked at the tasks you can perform using the selection you've created. Thank you for watching. For more information on how to improve your productivity with SuperOffice CRM, please visit our community website.